Ladies and gents, Helen Dalson from Tanzania. She's founder of New Year's Essence. Tell us a little bit about New Year's Essence. Uh, New Year's Essence is a company I founded to, as an idea two years ago, but I started going out uh, to my customers about two years ago. So I found it out of uh, desperation and uh, I was frustrated because I couldn't get a job then. And then, and I did. What, what had you studied? Sorry to disturb. I had studied international business administration oh, okay. and I had a concentration on entrepreneurship. I studied in Nairobi, Kenya at a university called United States International University. So since in school, I was thinking of starting a business, but at that time, I had no idea exactly what I wanted to do with my life and after school. So after university, I went to around the world and I came back home and I, was, I wanted to be employed, but at the same time, deep inside, I really wanted to start my own business. So then this idea came about and from inspiration from traveling and the things that I saw outside there that were not available in my country, then I thought, why not create that for me, like for, 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 for the people that are here, would love to use natural soaps which are beautiful and, and well scented and the herbs, and the healing plant oils and butters. So definitely that's what it came about. And I've been using these natural oils like forever. Since I was young, my mother could soothe my body with olive oil every day. Then I did not understand, but now I get to see exactly what was happening. And now I get to understand better about my business and, the, and everything around it. A, a lot of um, uh, you know, entrepreneurs who, like yourself, who study entrepreneurship at, um, at, a, at a tertiary institution, after they finish, as much as they've got great ideas, it's difficult for them to start. A lot of us don't get funding. How difficult was that for you? Um, luckily, my parents really did their best to fund me in the beginning, which by that time I had lost everything after the funding because somebody really tricked me and I happened to lose everything. So, so, so you made a bad investment? Uh, or no, what is it, a business partner or what happened? No, I had, um, when I was starting a business, I contacted my parents and I asked them for funds. They were able to fund me at that time. And then I was ordering some of the oils and butters from abroad because some of the oils are very unique and you can't them, you can get them in Tanzania. So that time when my shipment came, I had, I think I got caught up with the wrong people and they just could not deliver what I wanted. So I ended up losing the whole shipment, the raw material and everything. So I had wow. to start from the ground. That time I had a small car, I had to sell my car and restart the business all over again. And how's the experience been? It's worse. <laughs> <laughs> it's worse because that time I, was, I wasn't really um, using the pub public transport, but I had to go back to that to be able to live my dream. Yeah, no, I understand. So, and and yeah. how, how, how well is the business doing currently? Right now it's growing. Because when I started, people were not really aware of natural products and everything. So the trend has been picking up really fast. People are, are more into healthy eating and people are training to be, to have a better body, mm. to live a healthy lifestyle. So people want skincare products to match their lifestyle. Mm. And that's where I come in. So mm. it's been pretty good. Well, we're really <laughs> proud and congratulations on featuring on the uh, Forbes 30 Under 30 Entrepreneurs. Thank you very and much. And also, I'd like to know from you the importance of events like the World um, Entrepreneur of the Year Forum. The importance of such events to us entrepreneurs? Um, I think you get so much inspiration from that because you get to see people who have walked to your path. Because as an entrepreneur, I still need to see other people who are walking this path of entrepreneurship to learn from them and to connect with them because connection is everything and networking yeah. is everything right now. As much as you have a good product, once you are alone, you cannot connect with people, it's hard. So for, for that forum to be there, I think it connects us as entrepreneurs who are starting and who have made it, for us to connect and understand and learn from each other. Well, what are, oftentimes we encourage entrepreneurs or um, young professionals that they start their own businesses, but we never really focus on the running of the business. What makes you keep New Year's essence running? How do you keep it running? Because they say a lot of small businesses fail within the first three years. Uh, I think for me, I need to I really focus on what I want to do next. Like if I launch a product today, then I have to think of its growth. Like I listen to my customers more than I listen to my own ideas. Because <laughs> yeah. that's why it keeps growing. Because if you put your idea out there, your customer doesn't like it, that's the end of you. So I try to improve. I try to live within my business means so that we can keep everything running. So yeah, basically that's what I 
do. So apart from your own stores, do you also supply other clients? Yes, I do. We just opened a store about four months ago in Stone Town. It was kind of scary because it's the first time I'm opening a store and I'm just there waiting for the first client and it finally happened. So it's really amazing. And I also do wholesale to other stores because I concentrate on uh, spas and, and high-end boutiques and cosmetic shops. So we do do the wholesale at the same time. Helen Dawson, we are really proud of you, my sister. You guys are <laughs> you guys are the ones that are making our continent of Africa really proud, especially the fact that you're a young lady. It's beautiful to see um, young sisters doing well in business. We wish you nothing but greatness and success with your business and all the best. Thank you, Thank you so much. And how do people get in touch with your company? Do you guys have a website? Or? Uh, the website is coming up. Uh, we're doing our photo, product photography in about two or three weeks. So for now, they can get us through our email. Which uh, is? Info at newyearsessence.com. New Year's Essence, how do you spell that? N-U-Y-A-S-E-S-E-N-C-E. -S -S -E -S -E. Okay, so it's N-U-Y-A-S -S 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 and then yes. essence, as in E-S-S-E-N-C-E. -S -E. Yes, yes. And dot also dot com. Dot com, okay. And also you can get us through our social media at New Year's Essence, all, all of them, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. 